Hey guys, Monday morning. I've uh, already had a few conference calls and uh, got a semi coming to the shop right away to pick up some canola seed. So I gotta head out there and do that. Gotta print off a bill of lading for them. And gotta sign a couple of grain contracts here, finish up a few things in the office, and I gotta rush out there. Got him. Let's go. Brent left the heater on, and it's warm in here, and fuel's not cheap, so Brent, what the heck? This semi is coming for this pallet. This whole stack of seed. But first, we have to figure out how to get this moved. Somehow I have to figure out how to use my, use the clutch with the gas, with the brake. while using my hands. Look at that. Brent left the tools out. No, it's another thing I gotta deal with. Check it out. So, uh, you can't tell, but the road's out here. Oh, the road's out there. To the shop here, to the skirt. There's a bit of a decline. That decline is great. When we're, unloading, when we're unloading the seed off the trucks because the driver hops up there, usually they help out unloading and they jack up the pallets and they just gravity takes it down to the end of the trailer and I pick it up with the forklift and go put it in the, where I want it in the shed. But now we're taking two pallets here at a time. I'm putting them on the truck and they've got to drag it back uphill to the front of the trailer. Yeah, 1,500 pounds times two, two pallets. So I'm not, not going to be able to help. Can you imagine me getting up on this truck and trying to, pretending to push? Man, it's, I'm, I'm exhausted just thinking about that. Oh, God. This is canola seed. And if all you non-farmers are kind of curious what all this seed is worth, uh, a bag is 50 pounds. Every pound is... 12 to 13 bucks, so 12 times 50. While I'm waiting, I thought I'd show you the forklift we're using. Check it. I could use this to drive up onto the road, up from the shop, um, but I don't think I'll make it. I think I'll just slip out. These wheels aren't that grippy, and it's pretty icy outside there. Oh, here's the trucker here. Hello. Hi, it's Jeff with Rosenau. Yeah, how's it going now? Yeah. yeah. Oh, perfect, man. I appreciate that. Hopefully see you soon. Yep, talk to you then. All right, All right. bye. Bye. Sounds like he's going to move the truck for me. Whoop, whoop. You guys didn't think I was actually going to back out of here by myself, did you? I can't see that going wrong at all. I could have done it. He's here.
unfortunately the truck was left outside um, the driver parked it sloping downhill it's pretty mild outside the back tires the drive tires couldn't grip the ground and we just spun out facing downhill so my cousin said he'd come put it back in he'd get it running and park it under cover it's supposed to get like unbelievable unbearably hot <laughs> I wish it's supposed to get unbearably cold tonight and we want to start hauling some weed out towards the end of the week hopefully so it'd be nice that it was just ready to go when we needed it we got a new sign going up check it out it's a great sign right that's what I thought man I got such good ideas if I only had one good idea a year I'd be set and I used it on a sign ah oh, god so if you guys haven't hit that subscribe button yet and subscribe to my channel do that and also like it and uh, leave a comment if you want to talk to you later